This story has so many moving parts, and throughout this you will witness what is probably the most mysterious adventure I have ever had. There are so many questions and theories throughout this that it almost felt like we were playing some sort of mind games with the opposing groups. You'll soon find that out, but in the meantime, how do I begin this? Well, like any other, as a fresh bun on the coast. I'm on the train tracks, by the yeah, way. Is that you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Whilst I was meeting up with my teammate Ali, Red Tie had ran up north to Nadazino where he was lucky enough to find a car. It had all the wheels but no parts, so it was up to me and Ali to find a oh spark plug, radiator, a spark and plug. battery. Nice. Okay, so what do we need? A battery and a radiator? Mm-hmm. You find a car battery? Yep. Nice, nice. Yeah, but now nice, he needs the radiator. Dude. Yeah, all we need is radiator. Despite looking for the next 20 or so minutes, we simply couldn't find a radiator across all of Chernobyl. Things even got oh, desperate, and I tried Some talking to a fresh one. Clamp him? Are you Ruski? Ruski? I suppose now is a good time to tell you that yeah. this is a Russian server, so talking to people wasn't exactly going to be easy. Do you have a base? By, by any chance do you have a car radiator? Anything? Oh, I found jerry can. Nice. Full as well. We need. After searching for a little longer, I gave up and went to meet with Red Tie. But then, like a miracle, my luck changed and I finally found what we were looking for. Oh my god, I did it! What? I did it! I find one! Oh you did? my god. Alright, well, okay, I actually back. found one. With my new prized possession, I headed north to meet Red Tie. Not a Xeno. Is this you on the well? Yeah, yeah. Okay, the car. Let's put all the parts in. And spark plug and gasoline. Uh, wait, where's the gas on this? It's here, I think. Here we go. Oh wait, there he is. That's me. That's me. That's me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice. All right, you'll have to hop out right there. Let me. Meeting back with Ali and Cherno now meant that we only had to pick up one person, JLK. But you'll hear him referred to as Josh throughout this video. He had ran further north and was getting close to Vibor, a town close to the Northwest Airfield. Lewis, Lewis, <laughs> turn around and look at this guy. Look at how ugly he is. What? <laughs> Man, I'm looking good. Oh my I'm gonna god. I'm going to put the stuff in, in the oh. What? You look so funky, bro. <laughs> However, about halfway through our trip to Vibor, Josh had got himself into a little bit of trouble with the locals. Unfortunately, with his death, we had to do a quick U-turn to pick him back up in the previous town. <laughs> you just run <laughs> Okay, oh shit! Alright, go, go, go. Hold on, hold on. We made the decision to go back to Vibor to see if they had left anything on Josh's body. <laughs> she shuts my door. She doesn't know you ain't going nowhere. Wind is together. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'm getting out. Okay, let's do come, this. Come, come, come. One, one I ran, I ran up the road. Like, I'm okay, on the my loot's still here. You already clear it? You already clear it? Yeah. It's clear, it's clear. I'm in, I'm in. It's clear? Any Where bodies, no? No, there's nothing in here. No. Oh, bro, I left my, my loot. Nice. Vibor seemed unusually quiet. On other servers, bases normally stand out in Vibor, but we couldn't see any when running back to the car. Keep this information in mind because the playstyle of players on this server was definitely a lot more mysterious than the usual. With it turning night now, we thought it would be a great time to head to Tissy, as this is where the best loot would spawn and without a car this journey would take an extra 30 minutes, meaning we had the perfect asset to give us the head start we needed. This is cool, but Maybe we can with everything car. going almost perfect up to now, something was bound to go wrong. No shot. Oh, no, oh, oh, no. There's another car. You good? You good? Yeah, we're good, we're good. Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. no, don't skid out! No, 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 no,
We just got lit the fuck up. What happened? <sighs> there were so many of them. GG. Oh, good morning. <laughs> I guess it's a new server. No, he's talking to me again. Oh, do you know what he said? I was still alive. Yeah. Just well, while you guys, he's, I was just like, all right, GG guys, you win. He's like, good morning. And he's just started laughing. Hold on a minute. This guy has a white armband, but a little bit later, this guy, he had a green armband. That could only mean one thing, a grip alliance. I could smell the potential all the way back on the coast. It was time to start grinding to get the perfect revenge on a group who were probably dominating the northern part of the map. There. Our whole new objective now was to find these guys. We wanted to take them out as fast as possible, but finding a group of green and white armbands wasn't going to be an easy task. I found a crate. Oh, I'm coming in. Hello. Oh shit. Oh my god, nice. Looks like this mo's in here. There's bullets. Nice, man. Right, let's go. Although the main task was to get revenge, we had to do a few things which would help us to get there. And people who got in the way would I'm have to be dealt with, the, with uh, accordingly. So we only have five, unfortunately. That kind of sucks. We need one more. I see a player, blue forward. backpack. On the hill. Where? On the hill. Which hill? Which hill? Uh, have, I've hit him once, but he's. Uh, oh, I see him, I see yeah, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guy in front of me, blue backpack. Kill him, kill him. Uh, no, 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 guy aiming at me, guy aiming at me up in the trees. Yeah. I think I killed the blue backpack. Mm -hmm. Uh, guy, guy. Where, where, where? Where? You're good, never mind. <laughs> Our first small task was to build a base. We chose to build in this greenhouse as it was close to the airfield, so getting gear would have been hard. But it was also close enough to La Patino, the town in which we were ambushed, therefore increasing our chances of seeing the green and white armbands once again. After loading everything into this crate, which for some reason I could carry it despite having gear inside, we made the trip across the Cabanino. By the time we reached the base location, after making a quick stop at a helicraft site, it was getting dark. So we used this time to quickly put a gate on the house, before waiting for it to turn day. When it finally turned morning, our next task was to meet back up with Ali, who had teamed with our fifth member Frankie. They had made their way to Altar radio station, but someone else was also looking for them. Oh, oh. Shot no. oh. no way. No. Just oh, zigzag, no. get into the tree line. I'm trying. I'm fucking trying, dude. Oh my god, no. Are oh. they, is oh, it some? Oh, I hear that, I oh, hear yeah, that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the zombies over here, that I'm coming in. Oh. I'm coming up. I don't Yeah, we, we're outside here. We're outside here. Oh, watch the zombies. I hear ones. They're towards the sun, yeah? No, no, no. A little other bit way. to the right. R right, what? right from the sun. Oh, we got some. Wait, they must yeah, be no, super no. close. I'm shooting the infected. Oh, I see them. I see them. I see them. You see them limping. One's zombie. limping. Yeah, one's yeah. limping really far. He's. Go for the yeah, limping. In the field now? In the open. I I'm killed him, I killed one, I killed one, I killed one. Wait, okay, I'm, I'm shooting at a different guy. Two. Yeah, yeah, there's two, there's two other guys. These two guys did manage to get away, slipping through the trees towards Novi. But the guy Josh killed would give us all we needed. LAR! LAR, dude! No, no, dude. no. Usually, I would throw a kill like this into a little montage and just skip over it. But it had an important link to what happened on our way back to base. Right I here. see a guy, I see a guy. Far, uh, where? far. Where? Okay, no, don't two, 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 two. Fully no, geared. Where's, where are you? I'm, I'm in the trees. Like, I can get the battery. Did, you, did you switch to the other tree line? Yeah, I see him. Okay, okay. So, we want to go for it? How close? Go away. We yeah, yeah. Me. Where do you want me to go? Do you want me to help? Come towards us, come towards the altar. Whereabouts, whereabouts? Uh, just straight down, shot, straight down, straight down at the light. I see, I see what you mean, yeah, 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 wait, wait. One dead? One dead? I see him, I see the other one. I can't, hold on.
can't shoot him. Uh, he's too... Push down these trees, guys, and you get close. I'm gonna run left. Oh, yeah! Oh, oh, oh yeah. We're good, though. Oh my god, that's a big gun. Yeah, yeah. I think we need Fully to pull suppressed. Him, he's aiming at me, he's aiming at me. Where? I hear the shot. Wait, there, I see him, I see him. Oh, come on, you. Don't shoot me in the back. I see him. I see him, I see him, he's- Oh, he got me, dude! I got him, he's dead! Oh, dude, he got me, I'm, I'm just laying, I'm laying in the bush. Okay, I killed him right here, I'm looting. Oh my god! Let me see. shit. Oh, bro, oh my- Oh my god, I can get his bag, I'm gonna get his bag and fill it with gear. Wait, this guy had I'm, the same clothing, guys, this guy has the exact same clothing of the guy we just killed. Um, the guy with the LAR. Sure yeah, that. exact same yeah, he clothing. He does, yes, he's got the same, like, style, I know what you mean. Oh, does he? Interesting. I'm getting his Winchester. Shot nothing. Yeah, you grab what you can, Josh. I'm gonna go look the other guy. That guy might have a pit carrier because oh a headshot. Oh my god. G G G Lewis, man. The only thing is, like, I moved. I feel like I SVD. Got in the way. SVD. No on way. SVD. No way, dude. Pristine plate carrier, spare one. Elior as well. Shut oh up. my <laughs> god. We well, got him all. Jammy, man. Just to clarify our theory, I later found out that the first guy we killed did also have an orange armband, but Frankie had taken it before I got to the body. Josh killed that guy here, and I killed the other two down here. These guys were running straight towards each other, meaning we had just met our second, well technically third group. The green and white armbands were last seen here. You'll see a lot of this map, as it will be updated as we learn more about these groups. In the meantime we returned to base. With all the loot we just got, we had to make some story so it wouldn't despawn. We could craft small boxes by combining planks and nails. It turned out getting your hands on other forms of storage such as tents was rather rare. So these boxes were our saving grace. Hereafter, me, Josh and Red Tie stored all the loot away before going back out yet again to meet with Ali and Frankie who had died in the last firefight. About time we finally hey, met you. We finally met Howard, <laughs> yeah. For the rest of the night, we got into some firefights, but they didn't mean anything to us. Yes, they allowed us to build up our supplies in the base, but they did not reveal any information that would give us a clue in finding the green and white armbands. I'm holding the left door. Can someone hold the right or the middle one? I'm hit, I'm hit, the I'm hit hard, I'm hit hard. Dead inside, dead inside. Nice, one more around the back. Got one, got one, got one. Left side. Nice, 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 nice. I think they're all dead. I'm looking. I see one, I see one. Oh. One's dead, one's dead. Nice. One nice. Yeah. Yeah. Left side of it. Yeah, 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 okay. Although this was great fun, we decided to call it an early night and get on tomorrow with fresh mindsets to see if we could find the green and white armbands. We had learned a lot so far about the three major groups on this server. The green and white armbands were clearly a dominant team with the amount of guys they had, while the orange armbands seemed to play a little more passive due to the fact they had fewer people, although they did have what may be considered as the strongest gear sets you can get on Vanilla Day Z. Okay, so we haven't uh. been raided. <laughs> oh, you put another gate on last night? Oh, you didn't know that? No. To start the day, we set the objective of looting and scouting in the general area we last saw the green and white armbands. Oh, I might have to take this, guys. NVGs here as well, boys. Nice. I'll grab those. Mo's and ammo in here. Smoke grenades. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, really terrible. Pushtoshka was our first stop. It is a town just south of Vibor and is a common spot so for bases. Oh bro, hold on, it's got Wait. a logo on it. Is this an actual oh, car? Like oh, actual car here, actual car. Where? Where? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, battery and spark plug. Wait, no, just spark plug. Oh, we've got one at base. Wait, there's a meat in this. This, old, this belongs plug, to someone. Yeah. Someone's left this here. This car would allow us to scout around the map much quicker, so obviously we wanted to steal it. Looking around Pushtoshka didn't provide us with a spark plug in order to do so, so me and Red Tie started to head towards Vibor to look for one, as we didn't want to use the spare one we had in the base. This was when we met the owners. I'm dead. Oh my god, dude. Whoa. Holy shit, there's so Whoa. many. There are so many. Let me introduce you to the Yellow Armbands, another large group who lived in the area. 
Red Tie, Josh and Frankie killed a few of them but ultimately were met with a UR dead screen. By that time I was almost back and what I found next was truly puzzling. Wait, is this another car? No shot, bro. What car is it? It's a Lada. Or an Olga, sorry. Olga. What colour? Black. <gasps> Where? Uh, you know the yellow house on the hill? On the <laughs> uh, there's a guy at the house. He's literally in the house. Which? Hmm. Which house? Wait. Did he just get one tapped? I'm not dead yet, I'm on con. Which house is it, Lewis? The yellow one that sits on its own between Pustoshka and VMC. Oh yeah, that one. Is there a base there, do you think? Maybe. Black Olga, was it did it look like someone had it or was it a spawn? Yeah, yeah, no, someone's definitely parked it there. That's the same adder or, or sedan that ambushed us. Yeah, yeah. A black one. You guys good? No, I've just been shot. Ah, uh, really? I'm trying to find a spot for my- Wait, wait, oh, I'm dead. Oh my god, bro, yellow armband. This black Olga could be the same car that belonged to the green and white armbands. But why did the yellow armbands have control of it? Our two guesses were they stole it, or maybe they were allied with them. Only time would tell. Now you may wonder how I knew the yellow guys lived in that green building. Well, Frankie actually met one of the yellow armbands that had been killed when running back up. The information he was about to give me would change everything. Hello. Hey. Hi. Hey buddy. How you doing Hello. That? Hello. Have you got a base tie? Yes, I'm going to base and sprint. Oh yeah? Well, where, where's your base? Yeah. Uh, Viber or Pushtoshka. Oh. My friends, uh, I am little speak English. Uh, yeah man, no worries. But um, yeah. do you know any green armbands? No, I have yellow armbands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But do you know anyone who has green? Any other team who has green armbands? Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. Do you know where they live? Uh, <laughs> I'm I'm bad English. Bad. Um. Uh, my killing. Their base. Uh, the, the green armbands. Green armbands. Their base. Where? Where is their base? Okay. Uh, Vibor. Green armbands. Vibor. Green armbands are Vibor, right? They, okay. Okay. And yeah, uh, yeah. and you guys, yellow, are in Pushtoshka, right? Uh, yeah. Yes. Yes. Right. Okay. And do you live in the uh, green green building? Yes. Yeah? Green. This was pretty much the turning point for us. We now knew of the Green Armband's base location somewhere in Vibor. He also confirmed that his team, the Yellow Armbands, lived in the Green Building in Pushtoshka. This meant all we needed to do was find the White Armbands, if that was even going to be possible. Due to the fact he gave us this information, we wouldn't add them to our list of raid targets, which was currently the Green and White Armbands. But we couldn't just let them off completely. Remember that car? Zombie's gonna aggro as soon as I'm I jump sneaking. this fence. I can check, I can... Um, I can check if you want, I can check. I'm checking if the parts are there. Carefully these windows on this base. Yeah, you can't yeah. see out them there, they're blocked up. Oh, the zombie's gonna be aggroed on me, fuck. <gasps> Pass it there, bro, go for it, go for it, go for it. Go, go, go. Okay, there's a zombie, I'm no! Oh, you're aiming, Jesus. My bad. I'm holding the front, I'm holding the front. Yeah, I'm holding the doors from the room behind. Go straight back, go straight behind you. Go, 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 go. Oh, 
go, go. All right, we got it. Gotta get out of town here first. Just literally straight, straight south as if you can. Yeah, yeah. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Right there, yeah. Go, yeah, dude, go. Right. I'm going, I'm going. Nice. Do you want to park up up here real quick and we can... <laughs> yeah, just jump in. Park up double red or... No, just chill. Go, 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 go. Just get out of here. Turn left. Oh, yeah. Hey, this one is good, this is good. We this immediately good. returned home with this car. We were making a lot of noise, so our next task was to upgrade the base as much as possible. See, upgrading the gates from wood to sheet metal meant it would take an extra 4 grenades per wall to get into our base. However, our base's security was not at its strongest due to the fact we still had dial locks. We could use the car to get to Tissy where we had a good chance of finding some code locks as they only spawned at hey, tier I'm 4 military. Oh, okay, what you do? Jesus! Tree just go, 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 go. Oh, oh, oh. Cut, cut, tree just cut down. Yeah, yeah, they're building. Pushing. Good He's shot. Dead. There's one outside. Oh, There's gonna be there. one outside. We cut down the tree. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna say the building. I'm gonna say the building. Go oh, we did. Well, kill it, kill it. Wait, wait. Uh, is this open? Can we loot him? Can we yeah, crawl through? You can loot him, dude. I can loot him. You can oh, loot him. You can loot him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's got, he's got um, combination lock. No take way. It. He's got nails and everything, dude. Just take it, take it. He's got a black armband as well. I'm keeping that. Yeah, yeah. yeah in you, the tree, you. in the tree. Cut the. Lock. You got. You good? Is that headshot? Dead, dead. Nice. I'm pushing it. There could be another. By the rock. By the rock. By the rock. Where? Oh, yeah. One more. Come, 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 down. Nice. Nice, dude. Might be more, boys. Might be more. Yeah, yeah, you need to cover and bandaging. I'm going to fall back to the car or to the building, actually. Uh. After this fight on the way to Tissy, we realized we could have lost the car if we didn't see that tree fall. So instead, we changed plans. We built a garage next to our base because when I died earlier to the yellow armbands, I spawned in West Cherno where I seen another car. If we got this, then we wouldn't have to worry about losing one car, as we would have a spare one at base. Is it here? This down here, I presume. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh. Yeah, what are we going to take up to Tissy? We'll take the gun As soon as I had the white car stored away, we headed straight for Tissy. With it turning night, we would arrive there just before morning. The following day, me, Josh and Red Tide decided it was time to put our full efforts into finding the exact locations of the green and white armbands. So we headed to Vibor to see if we could find the base that belonged to the green armbands that the yellow armbands had told us about. And after searching all of the town, there was only one base. Um, oh, I think I found it! Where? Where? Piano building, just uh, in the town centre. Town centre? Yeah, not the one next to Officer Blue Tin. You know the one? It's just in the town centre, near the statue, Officer Orange Brick. Oh, that one. And uh, we can see exactly how many gates they've got. Four, five, Wait, I think. can you boost over this one? No, I Maybe, but what's the point? One, two, three, four, five, five. Right. So what is that, 50 grenades? One, two, three, four, yeah, five. Which is 50 grenades. And that's them. Yeah, this is the green arm bins, right? That's the green arm bins. Pretty underwhelming, I was expecting a lot bigger of a base, but. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you want to go Wait, get this the one? Coral? This one hasn't got a good look on it. So it's four. Four walls, 40 grenades, 
or the equivalent amount of ammo. That's what we needed in order to destroy this base. For now though, it was on to our next location, La Patino, where we had been ambushed by the green and white armbands on our very first day. There had to be a reason they were stopped in that location. So we're going to sit any bases there, I guess. Mm -hmm. Church is a raided base. Some wood storage is in here if you want to grab those, I don't know. Wait, you said the church was raided. Yeah. yeah. So they were probably raiding it whenever we pulled up. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah. Actually true. I found a pickaxe, do we need that? This is what they were raiding then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. good, good call, man. Loki, I want to say this. The fact that they left them, they must not need them. Finding out that they had just raided a base whenever we had pulled up on them explained why there were so many of them in the first place. But it also strengthened the likelihood that they were allied in order to destroy any bases around them. That would explain why the Green Armbands base in Viabor was the only one left standing. And any others that we had come across were already raided. So why would the one inside the piano be left alone? We had so many questions. But we still had not found any base that could potentially be the white armbands, so we continued our journey north to see what we could find. I mean, why don't we just drive around until we see a big base? Oh, base back there. Back there? Base. Where? Base building, base building. There was a car tent sticking out of it. Car tent? Ooh. Yeah. Go back, go back. Pull up in here? Yeah, we could just do that. Do that, do that. Yeah, a base in here. Yeah. Wanna boost me, Kyle? Or whatever. Yeah, it's me. Yeah. Windows blocked off in the back. Oh, I just heard a barrel. I just heard someone. Yeah, there's someone in here. What? I think I just heard a barrel. Sorry. Yeah, uh, no, I, I actually hear someone too. Yeah, you hear yeah, that? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is, there is. One. There's so many gates. There's so Sorry, many gates. Moving. How many, though? I can't because Frankie keeps moving. I can't oh, I mean, keep on. Should we talk? Yeah, well, in a second. One, two, three, four, Let me get five, up. six, and one, at least one sheep mill. Let me, Frankie. I'm gonna talk to this guy. Okay? Yo, yeah, I'll come with you. Hello, buddy. You hear us? Turns out the barrel opening and closing was just some sort of audio glitch. No one was inside, so we headed on towards our next destination, Star ER. We're going in front of us! Ugh, we're oh, fucking on bed. Green, 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 green. I gotta keep going, boys. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's oh. Oh. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. oh! He's gone down for Yeah. Let me out here. What do you mean, bro? Oh, you wanna see you guys dead? Bed, dude. No, 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 no. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, he's killed people here. Where's, where, where is he running to? I don't know, but this is definitely somewhere near their base. Was that green arm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are you guys at? You guys want to park up and follow him? Yeah, we could try. We're gonna have oh, to, but yeah, we're yeah. so which, far which though. Uh, just keep driving. I think he's running from his base, I would say. That's what I'm thinking too. We were getting close. I mean, look, a green armband. But why were they up here and not down in Vibor? Could they be with the white armbands? Almost got him as well. <laughs> yeah. What did he say? He said something. No, I said friendly. Oh, big base, right? Base, oh base, base. Oh, that could be it. That's not a big base. Just no, a... scar is popped off, though. You never know. We can scout if you want. Pull up here somewhere. Mate, we need to get okay. that flag. This is interesting. Oh, it's been raided. <gasps> it's been raided, dude. Let's just get in the car, head to Star ER. Hopefully it's not too far. There's someone Sorry, there. Is on the we are. I'm oh. dead! Wait, what? Oh, I'm so alive, I'm so alive! I'm Where's the car? From? Oh, fuck, fuck. We're both. I can't see. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh! He said kill me. Damn it, man. He was right in front of me. Both Josh and Frankie had been killed by a solo player who was camping the car. It was up to me and Red Tide to secure the loot. But like I said much earlier in this video, people played really weird on this server. 
We waited for approximately 15 minutes before this guy actually ran up to the car. I mean, I'm in the front of the car right now, just watching it. Oh, on the car. Huh? On the oh, yeah, yeah, I see him, I see him. Dead. He's dead. Nice. Good shit. Nice. Drive Is he running on band then? I don't think so. He was fully geared. Throw, geared throw, throw everything yeah, 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 in the yeah, car, yeah, boys, and come straight down south. Wait, so I'm trying to get a Berezina spawn. I'm gonna get the closest, the furthest northern spawn I can get. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, look on that body, Carl. Oh my god, code lock and nades. So many nades. How many really? nades? Three nades, at least. Three? Two code locks, three code locks. No! Oh, oh my god. This guy had everything we had been looking for, but there was a reason he waited so long. I'm dead. Oh, 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 shit. Red Tie was now the only person alive. He had only one chance to kill the last remaining player as Josh and Frankie were still far from the area. But luck wasn't on our side. Red Tie had managed to kill another one of these guys, yet after waiting another 10 minutes, he was killed at the car trying to secure the loot. Around 30 minutes later, I got back. I was the first to get back and the reason behind this is because Josh had found a car in Severograd which he was repairing hoping me and Red Tie would be able to secure the loot on our own. See, the blue gunter had got a ruined wheel during the firefights, meaning it couldn't move very fast at all. However, when I did arrive, it was gone. Yeah, it was so weird, man, because I was just, I literally just jumped in the car and sat in the driver's seat. A guy comes out of the trees, you know. Oh my god, so much good. Oh my god. Oh, that's a start. oh my god, look here. With the wheel being ruined, the car could only move so far and the closest town was Star ER. Wait. What? Might have found the base. There's a cut down tree here. There's a fire on inside. Where's the car though? Unless there's a way to pick up teammates. And now kind of turn a little bit more left. Nope, he's on me. Green armbands, green armbands! Where? Where, where, where? In town. He, there's a guy there? Yes, green armbands. I told you we were getting closer to something, but why were they here exactly? That question would be answered fairly soon. In the meantime, we were about to learn all about that weird play style I had mentioned. Are you? Oh shit, I see him. Where, where, right where? in front of me. Right in front of me. Where? Um, um. Nice. He saw me somehow. I'm covering the house. Yeah, they're coming, they're, coming the house. Right. they're coming out the many? house. They're coming out the house. How many? How many? One. Which house is it? Which house is it? Oh, I miss him. There's, there's... How many? How many? Uh, one's come out, but there's another one inside. Привет, мой друг. Are you sure it's here? Mm-hmm. 100 percent Uh dude. Mm-hmm. I got a code lock. Another code lock here. No way. Can I come in? Yeah, come in. Wait, he's prone right here. Where? We can kill him. He's right he's right there. What the here, here. Shut the Bro, oh, this could be such a good raid. Oh it's two it's three to get to their top. Do you think they've set up this base as like a kind of... Shush, shush, shush. You hear one outside? <gasps> He's just moved. He's just moved. Hey, do you not hear? To, to yeah, behind yeah, us to our I right, do. our left, is that another guy? Yeah. Wait for him to come in. It was now our turn to play the waiting game. Whilst Josh held the gate inside the base patiently waiting for him to open it, I was outside looking for the second guy I had seen come out of the base. Knowing now how these guys played, I knew that if I killed the second guy, or if he killed me, then the guy inside was likely to push out. 
This would allow Josh to gain full access to the lower part of the base. What if this guy to open his door still? So I'm gonna try and find where the guy is hiding in the building, like to the east. I'm not exaggerating whenever I say I searched the entire town for this guy. Josh was still inside holding the gate, but the guy in there had not moved an inch. It was upon running back to meet with Josh that I finally found the guy. Or should I say he found me. I'm oh. dead, he's right outside. Shush. Just like we had anticipated, as soon as I was killed, the second guy opened their gate to push out and Josh managed to kill him before also killing the other guy. He took all the gear he could possibly get his hands on and moved west into the tree line to make a stash so that if he did die, at least we had something to show for this fight. By this stage though, Red Tie had made his way back and just in time too. Uh, car, 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 car. White Ada. White Ada in town right now. It just pulled up. It's, it's no, yeah, yeah, it's parking. It's parking. They're getting out. They're getting out. A group of white armbands arrived in town in a white Ada. Despite Red Tie and Josh's best efforts, they eventually fell victim to being outnumbered and outgunned. This only reinforced our theory of a large alliance between these groups, and our theory at the end of all of this was that this base in Starry Yar belonged to the White Armbands, but the Green Armbands had access to it in order to operate in the north, and that the Vibor base was there to allow them to operate around the airfield, and that both groups shared both bases. 30 minutes later, I returned to Starry Yar to collect the stash that Josh had made before meeting the team in a town just to the south. We may have lost the blue gunter, but we could get that black gunter that Josh had found when running back up the first time that he had died. Okay, let's go. After gaining all this intel, we made our way back to base, stored the cars, and called it a night. Just to bring everything we have learned so far together, I want to lay it out all on one map. On our very first day, we were ambushed by a group of green and white armbands in Lopatino. Thanks to the yellow armbands who lived in Pustoshka, we had learned that the green armbands had a base in Vibor, which we found to be located in the piano building, as it was the only base in town that was not raided. But, at this stage, we didn't have any sort of idea for the white armbands until we dedicated a day to finding some information on where they could live. By the end of that day, our new theory now was that the green and white armbands were sharing bases. They had a base in Starry Yar in order to control the northern area, and then a base in Vibor so that they could control the towns around the airfield. If we wanted to get our revenge by destroying both of their bases, then we would have to do a lot of looting and PvP in order to build our ammo and explosive supply. So, our next day was dedicated to just that. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. I just oh, got shot at. Oh, my god. We need to pull over. We need to pull over. He's super low. He's dead. dead. Nice. 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 Good shit. Okay, okay. I'm not the end you go. No, one more. I think. No, there's one more. I think he might be. His teammate might be around that house as well. Wait, 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 wait. I killed one. Ooh, nice, 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 nice. No, he's not. He's not dead. What? He survived the three-weight win. Yeah, wait, I see. I see. Okay, he's there. He's there in the bushes. Dead, dead, dead. Nice, dead. nice, nice. Good nice, shit, nice. Good. One more on the road. Main, oh, main road. No, he's right here on the left. He's hit. Whilst looting and PVPing, though, some people had took the opportunity to move into our town. I think I find the fish on about red circle, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Go, look yeah. at it. Look through the gaps, Lewis. Look through the gaps. Blue behind you. Look at the, look at the back right. Oh my god, there's like 20 grits. <laughs> yeah. There's no way they're not loaded. With us trying to maintain a low profile in regards to where we lived, we didn't want these guys here. This would be a good opportunity to see how the rating worked on this server. See, vanilla rating means that we can use any form of explosives and ammo to break down walls, and over the last few days we have been collecting landmines, grenades, and all kinds of ammo. The problem was we didn't have a lot of guns to shoot the ammo we had collected, so the hope was to use these explosives we had to break into yeah. this oh, base, okay, which may that. have the guns we needed in order to use then. the ammo okay, supply we don't it. shoot it. I want to do it now. <laughs> That'd be ha that would be funny though, don't matter. You go ahead, go ahead. Clear. Yeah, you good, you good. Nice. There 
go. There, there we go. Okay, how much damage? Check the damage on it. Has it done any damage? It's Warren. Okay, I think it degrades very quickly. Warren is basically 50% of that. Dropping the news now. Yeah, there we go. Man. Nice, dude. Oh, nice. There we go. Oh, top part of it broke, yeah. Oh, that sucks. Wait. Nice. There we go. Yes. There we go. Code lock. I got nice. that. I got the code lock. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Dude. Oh my god. Let me see. The, the box oh, oh, bro. Bro. This was exactly what we hoped for. Loads of guns that would allow us to shoot the various types of ammo we had collected over the last few days. Not to mention the extra storage, which would come in useful because our base was starting to get rather full. Especially after transporting all the loot from the raid. Now that our neighborhood was all ours again, our attention turned back to gathering more raid supplies. Like, I mean, okay. oh, shots of tents suppressed. suppressed. I just seen the tracer. Oh, I see him! I see him! I see him! He, oh my god! Full gilly! Him. Full gilly! Nice. Where's he at? He's he's killed him, but he's he's just killed someone else, I think, or he was shooting at someone else. What? Yeah, yeah, another full gilly. What? Okay, good luck. The tents, bro. Yeah, wait, like near the truck. Wait, wait, wait. I'll be able to kill him here. Oh, he's on the bottom. On your side. Yeah, on he's your side. He's dead. The tank, right? He's dead. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. No, both okay, dead. I both dead. Tank of a dead oh, body, dude. Fog. Alright, I'm loading. Oh Yo, my dude. god. <laughs> I headshot this guy, so there's a plate carrier for someone. Yeah, it's like a plate carrier. Plate. Oh, they are loaded. The oh, airfield was a massive success. But we would need a lot more if we wanted to raid both the green and white armbands. And the best place to do that is of course Tissy. That's of course if we could get there first. Oh, two guys in front! Where? Three! Three! There's a whole where, clan! Where? Oh! They're ready to shoot! Orange armbands! Orange armbands! Fall back! Fall back! Fall back! Fall back! They're, they're so huge, man. Red armband. Back, They've just came back, from Tissy. They've just came from Tissy. Ooh. Yeah, I'm back behind you to your right. Yeah, they, see, they, see they hit me in the gun, bro. Guys, you need it's not Up you need to peek, peek the windows. Where are they? Where are the they? Windows. They're at the barn, I think, right? They're at the long way barn. They you need to peek yeah, the are. windows. They're gonna be peeking out of that. Uh, moving left, moving left. Hit him. Where where was that shot? Uh, he's in the window, right side. Bro, my game is stuck. I'm on con. I'm unconscious Bro, because I'm my game uncon. was frozen. I'm up. Yeah, okay. He headshot me though. Bro, I'm so fucking low right now. Yeah. Yeah, take this, take this. I killed one, full killed one. Okay, good, good. Uh, wait, I'm low though, I need bandage. Wait, morphine, morphine. <laughs> oh no, is that me? What the fuck? Yeah, that's sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I believe that's on me, but he's not. He sprayed him and he didn't hit me once. I'm trying to look for him. Nobody's in the barn anymore, right? I'm inside. Oh, no, not I the mean long white one. Uh, not that normal. Long white barn, no, 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 no. No, no, because there's you one in one? the tree line here and there's one no, where know. Josh is at. It's just think... that's where I got hit from before in that right window, you know? Oh, I see one, I see one up near you, Josh. Pushing you hard. Alice backpack. That's the guy, that's the guy. Tell me if he gets near the ruins. Tell me if he gets anywhere near uh, the ruins. Ruins? Uh, like, no, no, no. Behind, he's, that's north of the, he's uh, in the trees, like west of the ruins. Directly west of the ruins, he was in those trees. Is he trees. standing still, moving? No, he was sprinting up north. North? Yeah, he was sprinting north. I see him, he's you, directly... You see me? No, I'm no, he's... Oh, oh shit! Nade? Guy, he's outside, he's by, by haystack, haystack. He's outside of you guys. Hit him loads, hit him loads. My gun's jammed. Are you guys outside in, or inside? Outside, I'm inside. inside. I'm outside too, I'm, I'm prone. I'm, I'm prone he's, yeah. Anyone standing outside? I'm He's on here. Yeah. Give me a sec. Getting close. Getting close. I don't know why I'm not dead. I don't know how he's no, not dead. Me. Not dead. He hit me once. I'm red flash. Me either. Me too. Me too. I hit him three times though, at least. Getting an angle now. I'll try and snipe him. Yeah, I'm prone with my M4 out, Josh. 
I'm out, I'm out, this is me. This is me! Jesus Christ, dude, I'm sorry. I see you running uh, I think he's- Ah, oh, he's behind you, yeah, he's behind you. It was the orange armbands again, and because we had beat them every other time we had come across them towards the start of our adventure, this loss was demotivating. Eventually all of us died to these guys, but there was only one left. The guy Josh had died to. But not all hope was lost. I was almost back, and Josh had made a stash of guns just north of the barn. Yeah. If I could get that, then I had a chance. Well, take, take, yeah, take what you can, I mean. Take both guns if you think you can kill them, dude. No, I'm leaving those there. Did, yeah. Go push them. You're gonna, you're gonna be able to do it. There's no food, right? So they have a car. They're driving off in the white car. The same white car that came up to the thing. The white Ada. What? No. I just seen them. Could that really be possible? Another group within this same alliance. I've killed him! Nice. There's more, there's yeah. more, there's more! Bait smart. Yep. Killed the guy in the car. I'm yellow health now. Oh, is he good? I've killed one in the car. That stole them again. There's one more inside the barn, I see him. Killed another. Nice. I think they're all dead. I need this food, I need this food. Oh my god, it won't let me open the food. I've killed them all. Are you sure they're all dead? Just yes, two just guys. two, just two. Dead? One in the car and one in the barn. There's so much loot here. I don't know what... Yeah, I need to load the... I um, don't know what to do. I, I, if I were you, I would strip bodies and wait. Personally. Yeah, yeah, do that. I'm... Grabbing the car loot. He got it stuck on a wall. I'm dead! Fuck! I got shot in the back, they were camping in the car! Of course it was all going too well. I got impatient and wanted the gear that was in the car, but a sniper camping gave me instant karma for being greedy. With my whole team now far from the scene, it was fair to say the orange armbands had won this encounter. But we now had two unanswered questions. Why did they have access to the white Ada, and how did they get it back so fast? Well, the only reasonable answer was that they lived close to the coast and would likely have quick access to the highway which would have got them back fast. In regards to them having the white Ada which we suspected to be the same one Red Tie and Josh had seen in Star ER meant that they could be in the same alliance as the green and white armbands. See, sharing vehicles meant they could respond to different locations on the map much faster if one of the groups was having issues. I hope that makes sense. This changed everything because the three main groups we had come across over the past six days was green, white and orange. But where did the orange armbands live? Well, when Josh was running back up north, <gasps> he seen no. the white Ada drive past on the road. We knew that if we camped this highway for the next while, then we could answer the question of where the orange armbands lived with at least a general location. See, if they returned on the road, then it was likely they lived in the north. But, if they didn't return, then they had to live in the east because on this server you cannot build on the coast. For the next hour we sat patiently waiting along this road, with all of us spread out along it to increase our chances of seeing them again, but they never came back. That only left us with a handful of towns we had to check in order to hopefully find their base. On my way back to our base though, I actually died, but on the run back up, the others had found the key link between the Vibor and Star Yard base which would confirm our theory. That's it boys, our blue gunter at the Vibor base. They must have taken it all the way from Star Yard to Vibor after we had all died. 
With us now 100% sure of the green and white armbands base locations, it was just left with the question of where exactly the orange armbands were located. So, we started heading northeast and were fortunate enough to find a car for ourselves, which we could use to dramatically decrease the time it would take to explore potential areas for the orange armband base. You know, I just noticed this is the first time I've ever seen Ali with no glasses. Oh yeah. <laughs> really? <laughs> Alright, let's go. For the next hour, we searched every town we could in the east. All the bases we came across, though, were just single garages blocked off or they had already been raided. At this point, we were completely lost. None of the towns had anything to show. But what if they weren't in a town at all? What excluded areas are there? That's the question we asked ourselves, and sure enough, it brought along the result we needed. There's a fucking base in there. Where? 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 Uh, here, pull, pull up. Just stop. Just stop. 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 No, there was a shot, base. man. Is that a big one? I mean, not really. It's one of these garages. Oh, yeah. Holy shit, it is big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh Wait, my have God, they got please. the whole garage? Have yeah, they done the whole garage? It can't be done. They've done the whole garage. Yeah, yeah. they've done the whole yeah. garage here. Bro, this is new as fuck, too. I checked here not too long ago. Hold on, sedan in there. Uh, purple sedan. Purple sedan. Yeah, yeah, come to the back. Come to the back. There's a lot there. Oh. If we get up on this ladder, we can see in. Oh, that's an ambush. Wait, piss me here, Kyle? Right here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna shoot the zombie. Yeah, purple sedan, man. That's it. All the loot must be in here. Well, I mean, this is the most promising thing we've seen this whole time. Mm -hmm. Now, I know it's kind of a long shot, but this had to be their base. It was the only base in all the towns we had checked. This base sat alone, and also, if you remember earlier, we had drove past that green armband when driving to Star ER. The direction he was headed, straight towards this base. The only thing that didn't support this was the missing white adder. But if our theory was correct, then we know they are sharing vehicles. This base location also makes sense in regards to how the orange armbands got back to the barn so fast. It was fairly close to the highway and also not too far from some spawn points. We were going to stick with the idea that this was the orange armbands base, but what do we do now? Well, we had all the information we needed, we had all the raid supplies we needed, and we had the time we needed because on this server there was a cutoff time for when you could raid and that so happened to be at 2am. It was now 10pm so we roughly had 4 hours to raid all 3 bases. That countdown starts right now. It's already badly damaged. No way. No way. For real. It's first wall's yeah. gone. Damn. There we go. Okay, first one's done. Okay, nice. Okay, another wood wall. I'm gonna yeah. start on this one. Yeah. Ooh, there we go. You don't have to use nades. No, 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 no. Hold on, how many nades does it cost though? <coughs> come on, come on. Oh. You good? You good? Oh. 
Jesus. Hello, you know. <laughs> Isn't that why you can just throw it from here? Oh yeah, I could probably could. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lewis, man. That was, I thought you were dead. That I was certain. Wow. I was certain he was dead. Watch him. Hello, what? what? Water. Oh, it's gone, it's gone. Nice. Yeah, good job, good job. Go in, boys, go in, check. Don't grab anything, of course. Wait until we all switch out and then, because we need to get the car anyway, so you guys gotta lock it down. Or two of us go get the car. Okay. Yeah, don't grab anything. So this one is open, yeah, this one's open. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, nice. look at all these boxes. <gasps> wow. Don't grab anything. Holy shit. Nice. Don't think about it, don't take it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, oh, there's more boxes back there. Oh, oh, there's, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, there's, there's actually landmines there. Here, try, you want to jump on? No, 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 come here, come here, go in the tent. Oh my god. Ooh. Is there more? Jesus. Hold on, hold on, we definitely have enough ammo to raid in our base. Yeah. So far, so good. The timer was still going though, and we had two more bases to hit, and they were in the north. Okay, our best okay. option was to get the car from base, load it full of the okay. ammo we left in our base, oh, as well as everything from the raid, Did and go straight to Starry Yard. Well, I can't take the M4. Anyone got a spike gun slot for the M4? Can anyone get yeah, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, take the M4 in the okay. corner. I'm, I'm gonna yeah, start running. Right. I'm gonna start running. You gotta open the door for us. Yeah, I'll do Guys, yeah, so everyone get in the car, everyone get no, in the no, car. Thank you, thank you. Oh, okay. Unfortunately though, the car can only fit four people, and I drew the short straw, meaning I had to go on foot. I moved my way up past the airfield to a town nearby Star ER, where Josh would then pick me up after leaving the others off. Never get this one done up on oh. you. <laughs> Just ruined the boot, man. Everything was going so perfectly thus far, and we were making good time oh, too. But just like everything me. else on this video, <laughs> nothing really oh, went perfectly. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. What had happened? Red Tie was outside and was waiting for us to go inside. But just before we were all the way in, he closed the garage doors early, causing them to clip inside of the car, resulting in our deaths thanks to Daisy's physics. The timer was still going down, and if we had to make our way back on foot, well, we simply wouldn't have enough time to raid the third base. But then I remembered. Earlier that day, me and Red Tie were going out on a loot run in our new yellow Sarka that I had found in Severgrad. But just like the white sedan, oh, we met the dead. same fate. It wasn't until Josh picked me up on our way to Star ER for the raid that I noticed the yellow Sarka was still where I had crashed it. It would most likely just need a radiator, as the spark plug and battery are in the back of Sarkas, so hitting the front of the car wouldn't damage them. We knew we had a spare radiator back in our base, so whilst I ran to Star ER, Josh and Ali ran to base to get the radiator. Me and Red Tie would secure the loot, and then Josh and Ali would come and meet us again to finish the raids. Also, just to mention, Frankie had to log out at this stage. Okay, okay, okay. So, okay. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at it, dude. Can I get out now? Finally, we were back on track, but we had a lot of work to do. Come on, we're with some valuable time. Yeah, we gotta go. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Do not move left, Lewis. Wait, let me get in there, let me get in there. Don't shoot, don't shoot. Don't shoot. Keep an eye on your suppressors. Okay, no, 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 no. Keep an eye on your suppressors. <laughs> I'll, I'll just look out. I'm not gonna move. I'm gonna go one at the game, man. Is there no one's done. What's that done? Let me check the next wall, don't shoot. Okay, it's already damaged. Alright, let's go. 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 let us go Okay, nice. Okay. Wanna kill his We did the next one. One one door left. Yeah, just one more up here. Nice. 
There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. They even have a barrel in here. Oh Run, my god. Oh my god. You name it back. Check the tent. <gasps> Holy fuck. Okay, we have enough to raid. We have enough to raid. Check those crates in the corner. Check those crates. Oh. <gasps> Look at oh, this. Look at the barrel. Look at the barrel. No, 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 no. Oh. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Oh my god, yes! Oh, my oh, god. The weapon clearly oh gets in the tent! Yes. Yeah, break bread. No Just grab the ammo. Yes. Grab all the ammo you can. It's a vest? Are there any vests? Oh my god! They got so kits, much. dude. They got kits. Let yeah. me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. In, the, in this tent. <laughs> yeah, yeah, look, look, look. Bro. <laughs> grab everything look at we all can. the metal plates. Oh, oh my god. Are there, are, there, are there any. Can I. Wait, is there any vests in there? Okay. I don't know. Uh, move, move, move. Uh, nothing here. Um, Wait, there's more crates behind foul? here. Yeah. Dude, more crates behind here as well. Lockpick here as well. Oh, oh yeah, my yeah, God. Yeah. Okay, guys. You need basically all you need to do is drop all your empty mags, replace them with the uh, full. Yeah, I'm, I'm. Am I grabbing all the car up a bit? Just like with the previous raid, we took everything we could. We loaded up the car and headed straight with all the loot to our next target in the east. This is where we got yeah. shot. Where, this is where we saw the green arm right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Running straight towards this base. Oh no! Oh, oh no! You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. I think it's... As long as you don't hit it head on. Wait, what? No. <laughs> what happened? No, 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 it's fine. It's just a spark bug, I think. It's fine. I'll just switch it out. Not the slide, it's... No, it's not. Oh, you ran out of fuel, haven't you? Wait, what? You've run out of fuel. Yet again, it didn't go exactly to plan. The car had run out of fuel, and with the closest gas station being over three kilometers away, our only option was to run as the clock was ticking closer and closer to zero. But we couldn't let anyone get the loot we had to leave behind. <laughs> With time getting lower and lower, it was safe to say we were in a race against the clock. It would take an extra 15 minutes to get to the next target without a car, leaving us approximately 35 minutes left to rate this base. Alright boys, this is it, this is it. This is it. I don't know, I'm coming here in a sec. Alright, so their main building is this left one. Oh, it's been raided. It's been fucking It's been raided. fully raided. No. No way. Yeah. What about the car? Me. The car's, car's gone. gone. Me? No way. What the hell? Who oh, raided it? Yeah. Who could have raided it, man? That's... So <laughs> That's so sad, man. There wasn't much in here anyway, but it looks things. Yeah. Oh well, someone finished the job for us. A zombie. You see that? But who could have done this? I can't, that just uh, leaves more questions, man. But there's food right here. Hold zombie. on, hold on. There is one base. There is one base that we didn't see. That we. Oh my god, there is one base. Where? It's in Godzilla. In between Severograd and that beige building. That's the only other base. Yes, bro. Oh yeah. How far is it? That's from the here? only other base. The only other one it could be. The base we had completely forgotten about. The one that Kyle had spotted on our very first scouting trip. Oh, base back but we knew that couldn't have been the orange armbands because they had no garage to store a car. But it could have been the guys who raided them. If this was true, then raiding them would give us the satisfaction we needed. Who knows, maybe? Maybe... Oh, they have a fire going inside, dude. Shit, they're online. Yeah, they're online, they're online. Oh, Ooh, this All could right. be big. Don't go close, don't go close, don't go close. Don't go too close. Yeah, I'm, um... There's an open door. Josh. These are probably the guys that raided. They just got back, dude. They're cooking up a Imagine, meal. imagine. You think? Oh, hold on, look yeah, for a shed, yeah. look for a shed. Look There's for a shed, shed right next to it. Is it, is it blocked off? Mm, it wasn't yesterday. Could be now. I could try and talk to them, maybe. You yeah, have an open gate in there. Yeah. They're definitely online. Yeah, have you guys yeah, got yeah. any yeah. close? Are you outside? We're, We're outside, across the road. Yeah, across the street. I mean, is there. Should I check for the shed? See if it's been blocked off? 
Is there another yeah. shit around? Wait, is there any other shit around that could be parking the sedan? Doesn't look like it, not from behind you. Doesn't look like it, yeah. Unless those guards is down there. <laughs> no, no. Oh, yeah, have you got multivits, Kyle? Bro, they had a car. Um, they have a yeah, car yeah, thing yeah. in there yeah, as well. Yeah, no. They're gonna be. Mm. Oh, they well, have a metal gate there. They I mean, do have a metal gate. I mean, this has to be them. They've got braided. They've got braided. They've got a metal gate now. Do I, do oh, I they shoot? just shut the door. Just shut the door. They might I become. Know, a, I know. Uh, we got zombies here. We're zombies. I have to shoot suppress. I can take the zombie away and take it away. Do it, do oh, it. No, it's stuck, it's stuck, it's stuck. Yeah, but that's the thing. You're gonna wait until they leave? Wait, well, yeah, who's it's super close and open to get it? Oh, it's Kyle. Oh, shit. It might have hurt us. They already know. They already know. I mean. We gotta think about this. Might have to fucking start raiding it, boys. Online I mean, right? You wanna do it? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna start. We can fucking. I got all these. Hold on, because guys, on you me. have to, you have to save two nades for the end, so we nade yeah, them yeah, in. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Let me. Ready, so we're ready to shoot the zombies, and then we're we, we are. We are shooting. Forget about. What, we gotta get in as quick as possible, dude. Okay. Do we want to shoot these zombies? Huh? Yeah, shoot the zombies. Yep. Okay, got them. Okay, okay, let's go. Let's do this. God, Do you want me to start nading and save two like you said? Oh no, one in there! Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> Bro, I killed one, killed one. Yellow armbands. I'm down. I'm ready. The yellow armbands. We thought we wouldn't have to worry about them again, but in the end, they had won it all.